Hi everyone, welcome back to News and Infotech. This is Pushpa and I hope you guys are doing great. In this video, we are going to discuss about the placement. Nowadays, it is difficult to be placed in a company. Mostly for the freshers and as well as some of the candidates who have been passed with their graduation since 2020. Yes? Yes. Why so? Because of the ration. It is still continuing. But I will tell you uh, some of the tips and how to improve your skills during this period. Please don't stop uh, trying to the jobs. Please apply as much as possible. Like uh, uh, for the companies you have to apply, apply for the job roles. Develop your skills. As you are already a graduate student, the skills that you have learned in your graduation is not applicably that much preferable because the skills that need for a job is different from the skills that you have learned in your graduation. Keep your skills up to the level to get a job and also, also not providing that much placements for the students. Skills on Java, try to keep it up and also learn BSA which is very useful for getting a job because even though you have oops basic programming language but learning BSA is another benefit to add to your resume not that much useful while you are working but it is beneficial and while putting it in your resume will help you get a job easily I will tell you some of the tips if you are okay with that keep on using that tip like if you have learned Java right and you have, you have a, a basic knowledge, sorry, you have knowledge on a particular programming language and try to learn another language too. Being a single skilled person is different from being a skilled person of two other programming languages. And it is really easy because as you already learned one of the programming languages, so the concept will be same. You have to like uh, compare the two programming languages and learn from one to another. If you have the knowledge on Java, compare the Java skills from Python and learn the concept based programming language like and Java and Python contains the same concepts, right? Try to learn how it is used here in Java and how it will be used in Python. Much more better than wasting time, right? Yes, of course, right? And also keep on trying to be as a freelance worker because a working freelancer will earn money as well as will give you some of the knowledge, experience on the projects that you will deal in the future in your company. This period you can able to earn some of the money. It will not be a big amount but something is better than having nothing, right? So you can earn from zero to one even earning one rupee on your bone is a self-satisfaction thing so try to keep on working to be a freelancer and meanwhile try to apply for the jobs in the companies the job role i mean the jobs in the companies are with are very little low but keep on trying and also follow this freelancing work also because you can able to earn money meanwhile and you have and we will also learn a good knowledge on the basic concepts and projects and how to deal with the clients and how the work should be done and if in case you have a poor little skills like you have skills but that was not matched for the company keep on uh, keep keep on learning those skills and keep up your skills to that high because the company need the skills to that high only if there are only few jobs are there and there are number of candidates looking for that job. Only your skills will add up a advantage for you. And also uh, learn the basic skills of Angular, React, JS because these skills are also adding up a advantage and some of the companies also looking for at least the knowledge of uh, Angular and React JS candidates. Thank you for listening and I hope you guys will follow my tips. Please do subscribe to my channel and share, like this video. Thank you.